Hey everybody, welcome to the Waldock Way. I'm Jessica, and today's video is going to be a look inside our U.S. government, learning about America with curiosity and fun. This unit study specifically uses six of our mini units from the Who, What, and Where Was books. The ones included are What is the Declaration of Independence? What is the Constitution? What is a presidential election? Where is the White House? What is Congress? And what is the Supreme Court? Now, you do not have to have these books, but these are the ones that I suggest because they're the ones that the unit studies were specifically written for. In the U.S. government bundle, you are going to find an overview and sample lesson plan. This gives you examples for two, three, four, and five days a week and my suggestion for how to complete it. A bonus mini unit, which is an introduction to U.S. government. So this is going to kind of introduce and set everything up before you dive into these. And then, like we just said, you will get the mini unit for the Declaration of Independence. What is the Constitution? What is a presidential election? Where is the White House? What is Congress? And what is the Supreme Court? Now, if you are not sure what is included in each of these mini units that I've designed, I'm going to show you an example using the presidential election. So within each and every one of those mini units, you're going to get this page, which is our resource page. It gives you suggested books, all with clickable links, a YouTube playlist, as well as a Pinterest board. So this is gonna be informational videos, and this is going to be crafts and activities. Each has a clickable link as well as a scannable QR code, additional recommended shows and videos and games, and more resources. So in this example, the US government running for office, how voting works, and the electoral college. There is also always a custom coloring page. Kevin hand draws these for each and every one of our mini units. And then there is copy work in three different levels. So you have cursive, print, and tracing. There's also a notebooking page included. In this case, it is what is the presidential election? Draw a picture and write a summary of what takes place during a presidential election. Sometimes if it's a person, it's a biography. Sometimes if it is a location, it's more geographical, but there's always a notebooking page. And then there are activity pages. Here we have time to count the presidential votes. So we are going to count the votes during the presidential election. We have a presidential election word search with a corresponding answer key. We have a presidential election crossword puzzle, again, with the corresponding answer key. And then we have the timeline of the presidential election. Now, what I love about these is you can have your child look it up and research it for themselves, or in the back of the what is books, there is a timeline included. So you can have them read and write directly from there, and that can also serve as copy work. We also always include a few games in each of our mini units. They include a trivia card game where there are 20 questions for you to cut out and quiz your child. And then we include a timeline matching game where we put the date or the time frame and what happens. So this one is a little more specific since it's not happening over a long period of time. So like spring of the year before the election, the candidates register with the Federal Election Commission to run for president. In addition to each of the mini units having this, I wanted there to be a few more things. So I have included a presidential election game. You will race to become the next president. It's very simple, you roll the dice, you move your little piece, and then if you land on either a blue or a red star, there are questions that you would answer. So there's different trivia questions here. So like, what is the main job of the judicial branch? Or what is the role of the Supreme Court in interpreting the Constitution and laws of the United States? So these are going to be trivia-based questions and a board game. And these trivia questions will go over all of the mini units. I also included a matching game. So there's memory, they're all the different 
um, branches of government, buildings, historical documents, just a fun way for your younger kids to have a game to play and participate. And then I also wanted you to be able to have a mock election during your US government unit study. So I have included things for that. Posters for candidacy, voter registration cards, printables for making a ballot box, actual voting ballots. So everything you need to hold your own election at home.